Hello, Oasis community. So following on from the web wallet walkthrough, we're now going to look at the browser extension. The extension gives you all of the same features of the web wallet. You can see your available balances and the amount of rows you have staked. You can send and receive rows tokens. You can find out information on validators and stake your rows directly from the wallet. And you can reclaim any of your staked rows back into your wallet. So there is an extra feature of the extension in that it can be used to sign transactions with uh, decentralized apps built on the Oasis network. So that's an added benefit, but let's jump into it. So just as with the Oasis web wallet, you have two options from the start. You can restore a wallet that you already have existing access to. You just need the private key or the mnemonic phrase, or you can create an, an entirely new wallet. So we're going to create a new wallet. We're going to enter a password here and we're going to click next it's going to ask you to back up your mnemonic phrase immediately so you're going to have to take a take a quick uh, screenshot which i'm going to do for the purposes of this video and once we've confirmed backup we need to then organize it in the correct order so we're just going to run through this real quickly as quickly as I can and that's it so we've created our wallet successfully and you'll see we're opening up into this account where once again when you're on the main wallet page you can see your balance you can see what you have available you can see what you have in escrow or currently staked and you can see what's uh, currently debonding then you're able to send rose tokens to any other oasis address from here you're also able to receive tokens by copying down your wallet address or sending through your QR code. Next, you want to jump into staking some rows. So you're going to click over to the staking page. Here you can see the total amount you have staked. Obviously, we don't have any staked right now. And you can see the total amount that's currently in a debonding uh, process. So you can then pop over to the validator node page to review all active validators nodes and what percentage yields they are offering. You can see the amount of delegators for each validator and the total amount that's staked with them. So if you click into each different validators page, you can add a scroll and this is where you will stake the amount of rows that you want to be staking. So that's, that's essentially everything that you need to do in the wallet, there is another feature here where you can add an address book, where you can add, add your friends or, or anyone that you'd like to send rows to frequently. You can add them in the address book there, and then they're going to pop up when you click send. You can click this little button here and, and, uh, and click whichever address you want to send it. So that's it. Send and receive tokens. Review your available balances of funds you have staked and funds that are currently debonding, assess which validators you want to stake your, your rose tokens with, stake them, and then debond them and reclaim those tokens whenever you're ready.